Okay, we've got the uh, original card out. This is the original obsidian. I'm going to go ahead and plug our power up. I'm going to go ahead and turn the system on. We're going to see how this new card does. Or this old card, I guess you would say. System's powering up. Let's cross our fingers. We got a tone and that's great. See if we get a display. 3D effects initialized. It's hard to read. Initializing disk. Done. Initializing audio. Done. Loading game. Okay, well, at least we've got as far as we did with the 8 megabyte card. We've got a decent display. Everything looks good on this screen, which it did on the 8 megabyte card too. Now let's go on for some further tests. <clears throat> Intro looks good. Looks very good. No problems at all so far. Let's go ahead and hit the start button. Okay, immediately I see there's no glitch right here. Let's see if it happens. Okay, glitch is gone. No glitch there below the, the wizard's feet or the character's feet like there was before with the 8 megabyte card. It was like a block of blackness. Okay. Welcome, yellow wizard. Don't see any kind of problems. No glitches at all. Still no glitches. Everything looks good. The mountain king. Okay, we're going in. Let's see if the intro plays now. You this would be exciting if it does. All right, the intro is playing. Here we are. No glitches. I don't see anything. Treasure chest looks good. retarded me trying to play with one hand but I'm trying to hold the camera keep the screen on where the camera's focused and walk around a little bit at the same time but look right here you see everything looks great the chest has got textures the object in it has textures applied to it Since I don't know a quick way to do it, I'm going to turn the machine off real quick and try to go back into the area we were before on the uh, the other video that showed the problems with the logs and everything. So uh, just let me cut away for a second. I'll come back and start that back up on that level. Okay, here we are again. I was just wanting to show you the level that uh, we were on in one of the other videos that had the graphical glitches. You can see now this demo is showing no problems at all. The card seems to be working flawlessly. I believe it will continue to work flawlessly. And uh, just to prove to you before we get started on this level, there's the obsidian, the original obsidian. It's got the hold down bracket and the one connector on the end. That's what came out of the card. And inside here, uh, if I'm blocking light, I'm sorry. There's the uh, red bracket card that came out of a computer that I got off of eBay. And it is running in the system right now. 
we're gonna back up over here and load up the game. Enter initials to build a character. Select a character. Welcome I'm gonna pick the uh, acid swamp. The forest realm. Well, it's the forest realm, the acid swamp's the first area. The acid swamp. See, everything looks great, no graphical glitches. Here's the intro. We couldn't even see it the last time I tried the 8 megabyte card. Find the exit. And here we are. No graphical glitches at all. Destroy generators to stop enemies. Pick up the key, it looks normal. The logs up here, you remember those? They were white. They had no textures applied whatsoever. They look great now. No problems. Go over here to the chest, if you remember it. If I don't get killed first. Open up the chest, everything looks great. The item inside of it looks good. All the characters look good. No crazy squares on anything. No graphical glitches whatsoever. Can't tell the difference between this and the obsidian at all. And like I said, I do believe the memory was the cause of the problem, not having enough memory. Now it actually has two extra megabytes in case it needed it, but I'm sure there's no use for it since it was it was programmed to use 10 megabytes and no more probably. I'm no kind of video card expert, but I don't think the extra memory is going to increase your, your quality of the game at all right now. I think it just needed at least, it needed at least the 10. Everything looks great. All the items, explosions, creatures, monsters, shadows, whatever. No problem. That proves that you can use an old Voodoo 2 from a computer in a Gauntlet Legends cab as long as it has enough memory. And uh, that'll end the video. Thanks.